Virgos, hey my love, love, lovies. How are you guys doing? I hope everybody's doing well. I'm sending you a multitude of love, light, and positive energy. Thank you so, so much for all you do for our channel. Thank you for your likes, shares, and subscribes. This is your girl, Empress Meek. I am your spiritual guide, and I'm also a light worker. You already know. Here to drop some love, joy, and clarity on your path and spiritual guidance. Let's go ahead and dive in and see what message and spirit has for you. If you're not having your best day, I am sending you my love, light, and positive energy and encouragement. All right, Virgos, let's see what spirit wants to tell you today. I did your overall energy read. Um, and I pulled um, the cards that came out were move on. Then we got foundation and achievements. Um, we also had be proud of yourself. I saw that card. Um, so Virgo, I feel like the overall energy is you just standing your ground. I also saw the wisdom card. Um, maybe something that you need to study. Maybe it's something that you want to look into. You could be in the, on the break of a new endeavor or starting a new job or a new profession. Just something you're bringing to life here that you're very passionate about. And Spirit wants you to, um, ground yourself. Stay grounded, Okay. Time for you to move on and leave some of the things that don't serve you. All of the things that that aren't in your best interest behind. I feel like there are still some energies around you that may be pulling you back or trying to hold on to you. Trying to discourage and distract you. All right. But Spirit is saying, stand your ground. You're wise. So stand firm in that. Continue to do your research. Um, seek out answers. Seek out help if you need it. I did get that for you. Okay. Somebody is looking to move. Looking to... Um, own a new home. It's something that you're doing as far as relocating. Yeah, so Spirit wants you to do your research on that. Make sure you take your time and stay grounded, okay? Let's see what's going on here for my Virgos. Spirit, thank you so, so much for giving us love, light, and spiritual wisdom and guidance. I appreciate you allowing me to be a vessel on the channel of love and light for the Virgos. Thank you for giving us victory in every situation we may face. Abundance and overflow and blocking all negative energy entities, witchcraft and wickedness that may be coming up against our lives or this channel. Amen. Amen. And amen. Let's go ahead and see what's going on. You know what? As much as I want to cut my video short and take that part out just to get views, my spirit won't let me. You know, my flesh is like nobody else is praying. Everybody else is getting more views. And the God in me is telling me to stand my ground, stay on my path, and he will send me what I need. So I'm going to continue to pray. Um, and whoever doesn't like it, I, I apologize if it offends you, but I'm not apologizing for my faith, my beliefs, and how well it works in my life, okay? So I trust God and I consult God before everything, especially these readings. And I, consider, I, I, I suggest you do the same. You know, I love you guys. And I just had to say that because sometimes I struggle with that, you know, and it's it's like, honestly, with my heart, it's no question. It's like, no, cleanse the energy, pray for your people, just say something quick to at least cover them, you know, so I have to. All right, so I try to be a little more free on the other channel that I have and not really do it as much, but it's just me, y'all. So I appreciate you guys supporting me and loving me. My views did go down, but I mean, I'm going to continue to do what I do over here. So I thank you for everybody who's supporting me and who's there with me along the way. All right, let's go ahead and dive into your message. All right, take a breather. All right, so this is Spirit telling you that it's okay to breathe, relax, and enjoy. Um, I'm feeling like be in the moment. When you guys get your moment of peace, your moment of clarity, um, or just some a long time, enjoy it. Spirit wants you to relax, okay? Try to calm your emotions, all right? And know that all things work together for the good, you know? You're gonna get what you want. Things are gonna come into fruition. Slowly but surely, you're seeing progress in your life. So just continue to stay um, persistent. Continue to stay consistent. And continue to be encouraged, Okay? <laughs> Just like I have to encourage myself, encourage yourself, lovies. Make sure that you, you walk by your faith, whatever your faith is, and know that you will get a good outcome as long as you're putting good out into the universe. All right? And then next, release control. 
full quarter moon in Taurus. And then the other card was Cancer. So somebody could be dealing with a Cancer that has you all in your emotions. But it's very much you to seek emotional balance, all right? And then with this full moon in Taurus, release control. Um, I feel like you need to release control of your need to control the situation or the outcome. Um, it's important that you meditate, clear your energy, quiet the external noise and the internal noise and rely on your faith or rely on your beliefs of what you know, the law of attraction, um, the love from the universe and how things come full circle. But God is in all things, you know. So I feel like um, Spirit is trying to tell you to just release control and let me do what I do, you know. Let the divine intervention and divine um, time and take place in your life all right then practice gratitude all right um sagittarius could be significant be grateful for the things that you have already be grateful for everything that is happening in your life y'all honestly i'm grateful for everything i remember when i only had 28 subscribers <laughs> i remember when i only got 28 views i'm thankful for everything and look we even have another channel everything happens in divine time and in my life you know, and it happens in divine time in everyone's life. You know, as much as we like to be able to be in control of things, God is in control. Okay? So, just remember that. I feel like you got a lot of great things coming towards you. And I hope you're ready for them. You know, because things are going to really be looking up for you sooner than later. Alright? So, be prepared. I feel like they're saying, um, stay ready so you won't have to get ready. Absolutely. You know, that's something that I used to say a lot. Um, and that's a great thing to go by, to live by, all right? Let's see, underneath the bottom of the deck, it says, see the bigger picture. That's another indicator to have faith. You know, believe in what you know you can achieve. Believe in what you know you have coming towards you. Walk as if it's already happening for you, you know? See the bigger picture, meaning just manifest what you want and you have to see you doing it. See you becoming abundant. See you becoming wealthy. See you helping all the people you want to help or see you moving into that place in life that you want to be in. See you with that amazing partner that you want, you know. All right, so let's see what else Spirit wants to tell you. We're going to use some tea leaf cards, see what they pull out for you. And let's see what Spirit wants to tell you about this energy. I feel great things coming, you know. I feel beautiful energy surrounding you. Um, it's all about what you're telling yourself and what you decide to react to because people try you every day. I know Hold on. We're not let's let that pop out Yeah, so I feel like you just need to ground yourself for some of you You may need to do some planning for some of you. You got some studying to do I saw that for some of you You're thinking about starting a new project and there's some studying you need to do for that spirit show Virgo what they need to know please like I said, I'm over here working on a lot of different things myself. Slowly but surely getting ahead. Mm -hmm. This tortoise energy, I mean, things could be, you could not really see things happening. But behind the scenes, Spirit is working on something great for you. You know, you're a really amazing person, Virgo. You have great energy and things are going to work out for you. All right, Dylan's a relationship with a younger woman. So there could be somebody younger in your energy or somebody that you're dealing with. Some of you are bouncing ideas off this person. It's you and this person trying to figure out something. Maybe about to be business partners or anything like that. Let's see what else is here. Yeah, you can have somebody in your energy that helps you. Romance, celebration, or party. So it's something that's going to be happening that you're going to be celebrating about, Virgo. Um, I feel like some of you could be invited to a party or going to a party with a friend. Um, somebody could be invited out on a date. But I feel like there's going to be some type of celebration. You'll be receiving a gift or giving a precious gift. All right. So I feel like this came over here on slowly but surely getting ahead. I feel like you're going to get a gift for your hard work and your effort. You just stay in the course no matter what the outcome looks like. You walk by faith, right? And so I feel like you really believe in you being successful in whatever endeavor you decide to do. You have, you ask and you shall receive, okay? You you have asked. You put your petition out there into the universe and you're going to get an amazing turnout. It's going to surpass your expectations, okay? I feel like a lot of you are very passionate about your work and about what you do. You'll be shown the way, yes, okay? You'll be shown the way. And a lot, some of you may be younger. My younger people are watching me. 
you know, younger than me, you're watching, you know, seeking guidance because you're moving on your path and you don't want any confrontations. You don't want any confusion and conflicts. You just want your abundance. You want to walk in love and you want to do the right thing. You want to be comfortable being a positive, good person. Um, and you're in the right place. All right. So spirit got you. Marriage. Wow. So I feel like this could represent a career. This could be you um, being dedicated to something. Um, this also could represent a real marriage, romance, celebration, a party. I feel like somebody could be inviting you to a wedding or you could be going to a wedding with someone. Or somebody could be getting ready to propose to you or you have a wedding or somebody asking you to be their wife coming or husband. Sorry, guys, if I always <laughs> sound like I'm talking about females. No, I'm talking about both. Okay. Dealing a relationship with a man. All right. And then torch, spiritual development, enlightenment, awareness, and understanding. Okay. Somebody could be seeking that from you all right somebody could be seeking awareness from you or just understanding about spirituality i feel like somebody could people come to you for advice all the time virgo because you're a very good person you're kind-hearted loving and very wise and people seek your advice because they can rely on it they can trust what you're telling them so i feel like there could be a man here that may be asking you advice or you talk to them at work or wherever then also a younger woman here that could be in your energy. I feel like somebody is helping you out here. Okay. Let's see. See the bigger picture. Let's get one more for Virgo. See the big, bigger picture. Box. You will receive a gift. See, you're going to get a, a gift. Okay. You're always getting rewarded. I know that. You, I, you guys always get unexpected blessings and things just coming about. And you're like, well, where did that come from? Look, Spirit wants you to not back down from opposition, so show strength and fortitude at this time, and you will win, all right? You're going to get you're gonna get blessed. You're going to be very successful. All of this is going to come to you. You just have to be confident, all right? So be confident, Virgo. Stand your ground and keep moving forward. Push through, okay? Push through. All right, let's see what else is here. We're going to take these cards and move them to the side and get your tarot spread. Are we moving to the Tower of Spirit? Oh, it's um these oracle cards here. Let me get a couple of these oracle cards for you, Virgo. Definitely going to be receiving a special gift. You're definitely enlightened. You're going to be successful in everything that you do. Let's see. Let's see what else is going on around you. For Virgo Spirit. Yeah, I feel like a lot of you sometimes, look, it's letting go. You're letting go of a lot of different things like people, places. Some of you are even cleaning out your house, throwing away stuff because you don't want any old stagnant energy. You're starting fresh. For some of you, you're letting go of people that don't serve you or people that don't have your best interest in heart. Just fake people, phony people that's been around you. And you're releasing that. You know, some of you are letting go of hate and negativity. You know, deciding to go on a brighter path. You know, you want to be cleansed. You want to feel good. You want to feel whole. A lot of you haven't been smiling like you want to smile and be happy like you're tired of always feeling down or or sad or bothered by something or confused all in your head yeah a lot of you are letting go of that because you're growing there's a lot of growth here and for some of you you have totally cleaned your life up i feel like you have cleaned your life up I feel like you've changed people know you to be one way you let go of that old you and now you're walking in your new you're walking in your new life Walking in your new energy. This is the new you. New year, new you. New new blessings, new habits. All right? Things that stick. Things that work. A lot of you have changed the way you look. You're cleaning yourself up a lot. You look better. You're doing better. You're speaking better. Like a lot of you really have transformed your life. Yeah, I see you. I know this. Right? Let's see what else is here. You got moving toward the light. I told you. A lot of you are moving toward the light. You're moving toward the spiritual side. You're releasing toxicity and things and, and habits, addictions. Um, a lot of you stop smoking. You're doing better for yourself. You're like, man, I'm going to take care of my body. I'm going to take care of my life better. I'm, I'm going to do better, period. Um, and when you do better, you get better. And a lot of you understand that. Look, blessings. So you're getting blessings. I hope you're ready for this. You know, you asked for it, and now it's your time to receive. It's your time to walk in it, and you have to believe it. 
you have to see yourself walking in this beautiful energy. You're doing a lot better. And Spirit is very proud of you. Okay? Yeah. You're realizing that you're a creator. And you're realizing that you have the awareness, the spiritual awareness you need to get you far. Yes, you're doing it. Don't ever doubt yourself, Virgo. Know that you got this. You definitely got this, okay? Let's go ahead and get your tarot spread and see what Spirit wants to tell you. Something's on me pick. Let me see. Show Virgo what they have coming toward them financially, Spirit. What's going on financially for my Virgo? What can they expect financially? Show Virgo what they can expect financially. Somebody has a secret stash. Saving pennies, finding money, acting assistant, hidden potential. So some of you are going to be tapping into your unknown talents. I feel like some of you have been saving money, stashing money. All right, you're doing really good for yourself. I feel like you're letting go of doubt here. Money flow, hard work, putting plans into motion, building a team, taking time off, security. So I feel like any of these could be significant for you, Virgo. You're grinding them gears, baby. You get into it, get into it, get into it, okay? You are, you're getting to it. And your business or your idea, whatever this is you're working on, is growing, all right? It's coming into fruition. Financial relief, being content, loving and caring, a supportive role, job security, growing. Again, growth is here, okay? Growth is here for you. Look, rising above money issues, business taking off, profit, spiritual work, life purpose, and mission. I feel like a lot of you are walking in your purpose. A lot of you have gotten readings from me. Look at this. Treasure, worry-free finances. This is what you have coming towards you after ending the things that didn't belong, um, didn't belong in your life. After closing out cycles, rough patch. Some of you could have gone through a rough time or getting through this rough patch right now. Some of you could be um, having to start over. So finances are a little bit rough for you. But Spirit wants you to know that this is what you have to look forward to. Rising above money issues, business taking off. Everything is going to look good for you. You're blessed and you're guided. Look at this. You got this. This is nobody can stop this. Like you're you're doing good. You're moving toward the light. You're growing. All right. You're growing. And look, worry free finances, money in reserve, in excess, executive sales, planning, and hidden talent. Once again, you guys are gonna be tapping into these hidden talents. These talents that 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 are hidden that you're bringing out to the forefront. People are going to appreciate that. It's going to put you in the limelight. You're going to feel like your whole life is blessed. You're going to be like, oh my God. Like, I did not know it was going to be this good. I didn't know it was going to be this big. Bigger. All right? A bigger blessing than you ever expected. So believe and receive. Okay? I feel like you've already been asking for it. Now it's your time to receive. So prepare for this, Virgo. This makes me a little bit emotional because I'm so excited. You know? I'm so excited. You know, it's going to happen. It's happening for you now. Okay? So a lot of you keep your head up. Keep looking toward the light. Keep moving on your path. Keep doing the right thing. If you're moved to get a reading to see what your blockages are and remove them, get a reading. It doesn't have to be for me. That would be a blessing because I pour into you through my readings. But whatever spirit is guiding you to do, do it. All right, in all things, consult God. Make sure that you're moving in the right direction. Make sure you're not making any mistake about who you're supposed to be releasing. Make sure you're um, taking your time when it comes to planning and accepting opportunities and moving forward um, in your own path or starting your own business ventures and tap into your hidden talents, okay? This is going to bring you this wealth, but a lot of you, this is what you have to look forward to. Okay, a lot of money, a lot of abundance. So get ready, all right? Prepare yourself. <laughs> and write in the comments to me as this happens for you because it's going to happen. And you're going to receive a gift. I feel like this gift could just be from spirit to reassure you that I got you. You're going to be successful. You're going to be wealthy. You're going to have your heart's desire, Virgo. So <laughs> don't get it twisted, okay? Continue to be consistent. Continue to walk in love and walk in the light. All right, I love you so much. Spirit has spoken. I don't even feel like pulling any tarot cards. I really don't. But I will. I'll pull a couple. 
Spirit, show Virgo what they need to see. Show Virgo the energy that they need to see here. What else would you like Virgo to know about this reading? King of Wands, fiery, passionate, go-getter. Don't take no for an answer, okay? Somebody is focused and determined in this King of Wands energy. We have your angels bringing balance to your situation, temperance, helping you review situations and hold back from the things that don't serve you, helping you move forward in a bright way. We got the Six of Wands, okay? Recognize victory. People are going to recognize you. I feel like they're going to remember me. People are going to know you for what you've done. But you're going to be extremely successful. You're going to be remembered. People are going to be cheering you on. All right, you're victorious. This is victorious, okay? After feeling like you're left out in the cold, some of you could be having, having experienced poverty before or just starting from the bottom. I feel like a lot of you have started from the bottom and you're building yourself up. And I feel like starting from the bottom, now we're here. All right, and it's, now is not the time to waver in your faith and feel like things aren't working because they are. Look, time for you to probably hold on to your money. A lot of you need to probably hold on to your money. Some of you may be in hermit mode, but shine your light on the situations that need to be seen. Somebody is dealing with some type of toxicity here. I feel like somebody is shining their light on this devil energy. Spirit is saying, Use your power, use your gifts to see through this toxicity and these distractions, things that's coming up to hold you back and throw you off point. Yeah, it's time for you to balance. Yeah, because I feel like justice is here for you. Justice is absolutely here for you. And for anybody who is dealing with somebody toxic or somebody that may be coming back towards you, make sure you use your gifts. Spirit says shine your light on these situations and these people that don't serve you and get rid of them. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like judgment is here, okay? I feel like your life is under judgment, all right? And I feel like things are working in your favor. You're winning over the negativity. Your angels are here helping you balance. With this King of Wands energy, you're taking charge and judgment. Justice is yours. You're getting the help that you need. I feel like Spirit is reaching down, pulling you out of a tough place. This is God's hand on you, helping you, all right? Judgment, a fair judgment in your favor. Yes. Feel like you are you are gonna be abundant you're gonna be successful a lot of you already are you might as well say i am abundant i am successful okay yeah some of you could have went through a tower went through an ending we saw the tower an ending somebody could have been keeping secrets and everything it's their loss somebody from the past you could be thinking about this all right these people could want to come towards you but look you're on a spiritual awakening a lot of you are healing and this incubator state getting loved on getting treated by spirit, getting surprised, getting gifted, all right? I feel like you're you're elevating. A lot of you have been in the gym working on your body. Some of my men are super cut up, looking good, all right? You're getting new people, new prospects, new people working with you. Things are really looking up for you. Look, the lover situation. This could be you dedicated to a situation. I mean, I feel, I feel like a lot of you are moving fast. Fast-paced movement, okay? I feel like um, online you could be talking, typing, something that you're doing that, um, or some of you could be driving, moving around, but I feel like you're moving through this thing. I feel like things are accelerated. Things are moving very fast for you. So it's important that you stay grounded and keep moving, Virgo. You're doing really well, and Spirit is proud of you. You're about to see the outcome. You're about to see the turnout in this situation, and don't forget, like, you're almost there. Keep going. Don't stop. Don't stop. All right. I love you guys, and I will see you sooner than later. If you want a personal reading, all my information is down below in the description box. Until next time, I love you to life, and I mean it. Bye, Virgo.